Hello, sports fans and football fans. Uh, this is Sportsman Z, and I'm here with a game, uh, game from the past, 1977. We're going to do a little 1977 Chicago Bears versus the 1977 Detroit Lions. Figured I would get a football game up since uh, training camps are well underway, and football season is just around the corner. So we are going to play one week, and I've already put in that I will take Chicago, so it should um, put me into the Chicago game when it gets to that game. Now, I'm not really, I don't remember how good uh, the, or bad, as the case may be, the Chicago Bears were. I suspect they weren't very good. But we'll see. Uh, let me just reduce the sound here. There we go. And uh, yeah, so we're going to launch the game. And it looks like we're kicking off. Chicago is kicking off to the Detroit Lions, a game from 1977. And that's going to be pretty good field position for Detroit to start. And they have Greg Landry at quarterback. So let's uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll stick with that. And I'm going to go with balanced to start defensively. And they run the ball and they don't get a lot of yards. Two yards to be exact. And um, Horace King ran for two yards from scrimmage. They have a second and eight. I'm going, you know what, I'm going to guess run. I mean, Greg Landry's our quarterback, so, well, he's going to pass anyway. And we do uh, get King, King after he catches the pass for three yards, and then now they have a third and five. And now I will put in the pass defense general pass defense and it doesn't work they get the first down so jd hill makes the reception for nine yards and a first down for detroit i'm going to go back to the run defense i think that's probably what they're going to do and we called it but he still got four yards horace king did that is so we're going to put in i'm going to put in the run defense again no, nope, he's passing again. Greg Landry must have been better than... Oh, whoa, fumble! I think we can jump on it. Yeah, I'm going to... Well, I'm... Yeah, I'm going to fall on the ball. Not taking any chances. Nice turnover. And uh, yeah, see, we weren't that good. We have Walter Payton. He's awesome. But we got Bob Avellini at quarterback. So, that's not good. Uh, we're going to go line buck with the fullback Harper. And there's already a penalty on the play, but they're letting us play, so I don't know. Might be on that, or it might be on them. I'm going to decline the penalty. So we've got a first and ten at the at the um, at the Detroit uh, 41 yard line, and I am going to go draw play with Peyton. And he gets stopped immediately. Second and 12. Going to go end run with Peyton. And they, he gets some yards, but probably not really well enough. So we're going to go third, third and seven. We're going to go flat pass to the tight end Lotta. And it's incomplete. So third and seven at the Detroit 38. Um, I'm going to do a 
we're going to punt. Fourth and seven. Yeah. And I'm going to do a, cor a coffin corner punt. Try to pin him down deep in his end. That's not the greatest coffin corner punt, but I'll take it. He's going to have a first and 10 at the 15, at his own 15. And I'm going to look for the run. No, he's passing. He must think Greg Landry's a lot better than he is. All right, I'm going to go balanced on this one. And this time we, we hemmed him up good, so it's second and 10 from his 29. We're going to go, I'm going to look run. No. But he, it's incomplete. Nice. Third and 10. Now we are looking pass. I'm not going to double team anybody. I wouldn't even know who to double team. And we did, we got him, but he got the first down. First and 10 at his own 39. I, now I'm looking pass. And he'll probably run the ball. He did a quick out. All right. But he only got a yard on that. Now I'm going to look pass again. And now he runs the ball. But we got him quickly, so that's nice. Third and eight. You know, I'm going to pass and I'm going to double team Hill, the split end. Just because I have no idea who else I would double team. And Greg Landry is on his own and running for the first down. Unbelievable. All right, so I'm going to look for the pass. And they were, I think they were off, sir, false start. So he's got a first and 15 at his 45. I'm going to look for the pass again. This time he runs the ball. They weren't really, I'm guessing they weren't a great running team, because even when I'm wrong, he doesn't get a lot of yards. Um, I'm going to look for the run on this down. No, he's passing. Thought for sure he was going to try to run. And now he gets the first down. God. I mean, we only stopped him the first time because he fumbled. And this time it looks well. No, we got him. First and 10 at our 26, though. I'm going to look for the pass. I mean, that's what he seems to be doing. Uh, let's see, gains three yards, so he's um, at the Chicago, first and 10 at the 11. I'm going to look for the run. They do run, and we do get them quickly. Second and 10 at the 11, I'm going to look for the run. They do run. And uh, that time we get them, but... It's third and fourth to Chicago five. Now I'm looking for the pass. And we sacked Landry. He's going to have to kick a field goal. Put in kick block. And he misses it. Unbelievable. All right. So we're going to go end run with Peyton. And Peyton gets some good yards. Nice. And we're going to go line buck with Earl. And he gets a first down. Now we're going to go and run with Peyton. You don't want to give Bob Abilene too many options. Or too many chances to do something himself. Short, medium pass to the split end on second and nine and it's complete nice nice pass for by by bob abilini and 55 seconds left in the first quarter gonna go end run with peyton on first down and he gets some yards he gets four on that i'm gonna go off tackle with peyton 
No, at that time you got hemmed up. Third and seven, and we are into the second quarter. So third and seven, we're going to have to go short, medium pass to the tight end, Lotta. And that's going to be to nobody. So we're going to punt. So Bob Parsons with a nice punt. And it's going to be into the end zone, and he'll take it on the 20 for a first and 10. I'm going to put in the pass defense. Now he runs it, of course, but we get him quickly. So now I'm going to put in the pass defense. I'm not going to be fooled again by this, you know, I we have to run. But then he does. It's like he knows what I put in, and then he's like, I'm, we're putting the other thing in. All right, let's put in... Um, Pass, double team, the split end. And he runs, but he doesn't get the first down. Yeah, I guess his uh, running is not, his running game is not that good. Because I've been wrong several times and on, on runs, and he doesn't get a lot of yards from it. I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to catch the ball and run, and there's a penalty. Uh, he's got a first and ten. Oh, my God. What was it? Did it say what it was? Uh, all right. Um, I'm going to look for run on first down. No, of course he passes. I'll look for pass. I should just look for pass because he can't seem to run on me even when I'm looking for the pass. He's got a third and nine. I'm going to look for the pass. And he runs. But we get him. All right, punt return. I don't know what happened the last time, but... Schubert, I'm going to say, try to return it, and he only returns it like a yard. I'm going to go long and see if he can air it out. Because he probably thinks I'm running with Peyton, which would be a, a good guess. All right, we're going to go end run with Walter Peyton. And he gets stopped pretty quickly. Third and eight, I'm going to go off tackle with Peyton. And he's going to get the first down. Yeah, we snaked him. Snaked him on that one. Going to go flat pass to the tight end. And that's going to be complete for a first down and more. Nice. Now we're going to go off tackle with Peyton. And he gets a few yards. Got three yards there. It's second and seven for us on the Detroit 32. We're going to go flat to the tight end Lotta. And he's going to get it for the first down. Nice. We're in field goal range. Going to go looking pass to the flanker. First and 10 at the 24 of Detroit. And it's complete. Nice. Going to go line buck with Earl on second and two. And he gets the first down and some more. Now let's go end run with Peyton. And he's going to get not a touchdown, but he's at the one. Second and goal at the one. Six minutes left. I'm going to go line buck with the fullback, Harper. And he's stopped. Third and goal to one. You know what I'm doing. 
I'm line bucking with Peyton. And he gets the touchdown. All right, so if we make this kick, it's 7 nothing. I'm not taking that for granted, but that's what we're talking about. All right, 7 nothing Chicago. 7 nothing good guys. And we're going to kick off. 5-10 left in the second quarter. In the half. Great return again. It's up to our punter to make the play, and he does, apparently. I'm going to look for the pass, because we always stop him when he runs, and we're not looking for it. Got five there, second and five. I'm going to look for the pass. There is a penalty on somebody, probably on us, because they're letting him play. Oh, no, it was on them. I'm, well, definitely going to accept the penalty. He's got a second and 15 at his 36. Definitely looking for the pass. He's got to get 15 yards. Plus, we always stop him like we just did. Only got two yards. And I am looking for the pass. I'm glad I know this now, that we can stop him even when we're looking for the wrong play. And we sack Landry. <clears throat> Greg Landry sacked. And he has to punt fourth and 22 from his own 29. I'm going to set up for the return. Three minutes left in the half. I'm going to try to return the ball, but it doesn't go anywhere. Let's go. Sh let's start off with a short pass to the split end, just to see if we can loosen up that Detroit defense, and we can for a first down and more. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta haul ass anyway. So um, let's go short to the split end again. Let's go back to the well. Avellini out on his own and on the run. Not good. Let's go flat pass to the tight end, Lada. Two minute warning, and it is going to be a first down. Um, let's try, I don't think he's going to be looking for an end run by Peyton. You think, well, eh, well, Peyton gets some yards. Second and four, a minute 30 left. I am going to call a timeout. Let's do a flat pass to the split end. Avellini with all day, apparently, and it's out of bounds. Incomplete. Third and four. Let's go flat pass to the flanker. And he gets the first down. Uh, let's see. Minute 15, I'm going to go minute 7. I'm going to go look in pass to the split end. Oh, we fumbled. But I think we got it back. So it's second and 11. Minute left. Let's go draw play to Peyton. I just want to get close enough for a field goal at this point. And that's a nice run by Peyton. He might have a touchdown if that penalty's not on us. But it looks like it is. <clears throat> Second and 21 from the 38. I'm going to go short, medium pass to the split end. I don't know why they let us complete that play if it was on us. But anyway. He's going to try to get out of bounds, and he it looks like he will. Third and six. Uh, yeah, we might as well. Third and six from the 23. Yeah, I'm going to do a flat pass to the flanker. And we got the first down, but time is running out. Um... 
I'm going to kick. I'm going to kick right from there. Kick the field goal from there. Bob Thomas misses it. Are you kidding me? All right. He's got 30 seconds. I'm just going to put in the pass and make sure that we don't allow any big plays to close the half. And we'll go into the locker room. Hopefully, if Landry doesn't run for a touchdown, it's 7 nothing. First and 10 for him. Eight seconds left. I'm going to put in the pass. He does run the ball, and we stop him. And that's going to be it. So... Detroit is kicking to us. Bashna Brian Bashnagel is returning that, and it's not it's not a bad return. Pretty good. Let's go line buck with the fullback Harper. Got to keep the ball on the ground with this team. I'm going to go off tackle with Walter Payton on second and four from the Chicago 46. He almost gets the first down, but he doesn't quite. We're going to go line buck with Earl. And there's a penalty. Uh, we're going to accept the penalty. So we have a first and 10 at the Detroit 40. I'm going to go draw play with Peyton. Any fumbles? Do we recover? Do we have a chance to recover? Yes. I'm going to fall on the ball. Second and 11. Uh, let's go flat to the split end. And that's almost a first down, but not quite. Third and one, I'm going to go line buck with Peyton. He should get it. He does get the first down, but that's it. He only gets the first down. We got a first and 10 at the Detroit 30. Let's go off tackle with Harper. And he gets a few yards. Second and eight at the 28. Let's go flat to the tight end, Lotta. And that's going to be overthrows Lotta. So third and eight at the 30. Not a guarantee of a field goal there. So let's go short to the split end. And it's incomplete. I'm going to try to kick the field goal, but... I mean, if Parsons missed the one before, he's going to miss this one, you would think. But there's a penalty. Maybe it's on Detroit. Yes, it is. And we will accept it, of course. Fourth and three at the Denver 23. So come on, dude. Let's make this one. No. Parsons apparently was horrible at kicking field goals. Oh, wait, another penalty, and we're going to accept it. So now it's first and ten. We got no reason to do that. We're going to go off tackle with uh, Peyton. And hopefully we're close enough now. He's off sides, I think. So I'm going to accept the penalty. First and five at the Denver 13. We're going to go line buck with Harper. I mean, he's killing himself with penalties. Second and two. Going to go line buck with Harper. Going to the well a little too much maybe, but he gets the first down. Let's go short to the split end and see if we can't throw a touchdown pass. And it's incomplete. Second and goal. I'm going to do an end uh, draw play. Draw, well, no, I guess I can't. I'm going to do a line buck with Peyton. And he gets some yards, but it's third and goal at the, De the uh, Detroit three. Third and goal to three. Let's go 
draw play. No, can't do a little draw play. Only line bucket. Line bucket with Earl. I might have a decision here. But no, I don't, because Earl scores a touchdown. All right, so uh, if Parsons can even make the extra point, we're up 14 nothing. There is a flag on the play, though. Um, I'm going to accept it on the kickoff. So we're ahead 14 nothing. 6.53 left in the third quarter. And Eddie Payton, that's Walter Payton's brother on the return. But he has uh, not gotten them very good field position. I'm going to guess pass, of course, because we seem to stop the run. Uh, no. Not a good, not a good uh, stop for us. He got six yards. Uh, we're gonna, I'm going to guess run. I don't know why, but... Oh, all right. And we got him in the backfield. Great. Third and seven. Now I'm guessing pass. Pass and a double team, the split end. And of course, oh, it's Danielson now. And we just got him before the first down. So they're going to, uh, they're going to punt. And I'm going to put in the punt return. Five minutes left in the third quarter. Gary Danielson's on for Detroit. That's interesting. All right, so let's try to catch the ball and run with it. He only gets a yard, maybe a quarter of a yard. Uh, yeah. I'm going to go off tackle with Peyton. And he gets some good yards. Let's take a break here and look at the box score. It is 14 nothing, as we well know. Avellini is 10 for 17 passing for 120 yards. No touchdowns, but no interceptions. And Walter Payton has 17 carries for 58 yards. Not all that great, but a touchdown. And Robin Earl has four carries for 22 yards and a touchdown. And, of course, uh, Bob Thomas kicking a field goal is uh, not good. He's 0 for 2. All right, so there's some quick stats for you. Let's go flat to the flank. And there is a penalty on the play. And I'm going to accept it. De Detroit is killing themselves with penalties. First and 10 at the Detroit 42. Going to go line buck with Earl. And he is caught in the backfield, second and 11. Let's go and run with Walter Payton. And he gets a yard or two. It's third and nine. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go draw play with Payton. He didn't, uh, didn't exactly do what I was hoping. So... I'm going to punt, and we're going to do a coffin corner. And uh, did that work? No, it did not. It went into the end zone. I said coffin corner, dude. All right, so he's got a first down at the 20-yard line. I'm just going to put in the pass. I mean, 203 left in the third quarter. And he did pass, and we still couldn't stop him. He's got a first and 10 at his own 30. He runs the ball, and he runs the ball, and Horace King gets a lot of yards on that run. I'm going to put in the pass. Maybe with Danielson in, he's afraid to pass. So let's put in the run. Nope. Apparently not. I'm going to put in the run. I'm going to put in the run and key on King. 
and he gets it, and, and well, we did stop him, but he got two yards, even though I had to run in and I was keying on him. We're going to guess, I'm going to guess run. And we do guess run, and we get him, we trip him up, third and five. Now I'm going to guess pass. There is a penalty. Hopefully it's on him. That would be great. Or we can just decline it. Um, he was at the Chicago 29. I am going to, you know what? I'm going to accept the penalty because we have to back him up further than that. And now I'm going to put in the pass. And it's incomplete. So now there's no chance that he can kick a field goal. And that's a bad coffin corner, too. We'll have it right at the 20, just as if it was a touchback. Uh, I'm going to go line buck with Harper. And there's 13-17 now left in the game. There was a penalty on the play, but that was on us. Let's go off tackle with Peyton. I don't think they were looking for that. So, second and 14, let's go short pass to the second tight end. And it is good. And third and five, we got a shot here. Let's go flat to the flanker. There is a penalty. Hopefully it's on him. No, it isn't. Third and 10 from the 20. I'm going to go short to the tight end Lada. And it's incomplete. Thrown into traffic. Fourth and 10. Parsons on to punt. That's what we're going to do. I mean, they're down two touchdowns with only 11 and a half minutes left. And Eddie Payton can't get many yards on that. And we're going to look for the pass. Now we're gonna, we are going to look for the pass because he's got to have two touchdowns. Even if he can move the ball, he's got to have two touchdowns. And... I'm not real confident he's going to get that with a young Gary Danielson at the helm. And we stop him. Third and two. This is a key down right here. We're going to go past double team the tight end. And Gary Danielson sacked. Sweetness. What's he going to do? He's punting. 944 left in the game. Like in real life, a team would punt in this situation. 944 left. I'm going to try to return it. But, um, ooh, Schubert, what a nice run. What is going on here? That is a great return. Holy crap. Holy crap, Schubert. Got us down to the two. All right, we got a first and goal at the Detroit 2. Let's go line buck with Harper. And Harper scores a touchdown, his second touchdown of the game. And it's 20 to nothing. And let's kick the extra point. Well, now it is 21 nothing. And uh, I'm definitely putting in pass for the defense. I mean, defensive call, pass, pass, and more pass. Because that's all he can do, really, if he has a shot. And, and they run. They decide, no, uh, you know what? You're going to look for the pass. I'm going to run the ball. And I'm like, well, great. Run the ball all day. There's 8-12 left and you're down three touchdowns. So uh, we're going to put in the pass. The Chicago defense was obviously not very good. I don't think the 77 Bears were that great. Gonna put in the, well, although maybe they were. 
who knows? Defensively, they might have been. And certainly Walter Payton was. So who knows? But they obviously couldn't pass because Bob Avellini was the quarterback. And we hem him up. Second and seven for Detroit. 639 left in the game. We hem up uh, uh, King. Pass, double team of Planker. I'm just picking a guy, I don't know. And they got it. They got the first down 15 yards. But, you know, he may score here, but the object of the game is not to get a shutout. The object of the game is to win. So, looking for pass on second and 10 from the Chicago 46. He runs the ball. We do get him before he gets a first down. Third and four. Gonna look for the pass. Now they got Reed in at quarterback. They're trying everybody at quarterback. They're like, let's just empty the quarterback bench. Uh, he's, yeah, he does have to go for it. And we're going to sack Reed. So we take over right there. First and 10 at the 47, four minutes left. Let's air it out. Let's give uh, Brian Bashnagel a chance to catch him. A touchdown pass. That is not going to happen, though, because, again, Bob Avellini is the quarterback. Let's try a short, medium pass to the split end. I mean, you know, he's not going to come back and win. Oh, they even put in our second stringer, Phillips. Mike Phillips. Or Mike Phipps. Sorry, Mike Phipps. So we're going to go end run with Musso. All right. I thought it was going to be Peyton. Yeah, we're all of our backups are in. So even the computer knows we won. Uh, second and 10. Let's go look in pass to the second tight end. And I don't know if that was complete. Yeah, it was five yards. Bob Parsons, who's also the punter made that catch. So we have a third and five. And I'm going to go look in pass to Musso, the halfback. And he catches it incredibly for a first down. First and 10 at the, De at the Detroit uh, 27. I keep thinking Denver because it's saying Detroit. It's D-E-N for Detroit National Conference. All right. Uh, let's go off tackle with Earl. And he gets some yards. Second and five at the Detroit 22. Minute 15 left. Let's go short, medium pass to Lada. And he catches the ball. Nice. First and goal. 30 seconds left. I'm going to try a... Oh, no. They ended the game. I wanted to at least get some points there. All right. So let's look at the uh, box score. See what happened here. 21 0 Chicago. Big win for the Chicago Bears. Landry for them was 9 of 10 for 64 yards. Gary Danielson was 5 of 9 for 54 yards. And Joe Reed had no passes attempted. Avellini was 11 of 20, 129 yards. And Phipps was 4 for 5 for 34 yards. For them, Horace King had 17 carries, did the bulk of the work, 68 yards. And uh, Rick Kane had five carries for nine yards. Landry had two carries for 21. For us, Peyton had 20 carries for 66 yards and a touchdown. Roland Harper had seven carries for 32 yards. Robin Earl had six for 26. 
and a touchdown, Earl Harper and Peyton all had touchdown runs. Avellini had two carries for two yards, Musa one for no yards. So that's how it ends, and uh, this was great playing football and getting ready for football season, but that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing